Hey, I'm Elsa Ray, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to paint Mega Man. This tutorial took me about five hours, so I'm going to go through it super fast for you. Start off by blocking out your eyebrows with a washable glue stick, and then take a foundation to cover up the lower half of your face, just to make sure there is no discoloration. And then I go over top of that with some powder. Next, with some tag face paint in light blue, I am beginning the shape of Mega Man's mask. It's just an arrow that goes over my eyes. Then I'm using Snazaroo Red and painting the red part of Mega Man's helmet. And then pulling that light blue straight up from the jewel onto my hair. With the tag face paint in dark blue, I fill in the negative space on my forehead, making an almost 90 degree angle. And also fill in the rest of my hair. I go back to the light blue and I fill in everything that didn't get filled in and also bring that on to the sides of my face. With tag white and tag lime green, I am making Mega Man's eyes. I forgot to do it on camera, but this is what it should look like. Now I'll be using some DFX white, some Snazaroo pink, and some Snazaroo black to create Mega Man's teeth, Mega Man's giant tongue, and the black ear things on the side of his helmet. I've got a tag white, an unknown shimmery brown, and a tag brown. I mix the white and the shimmery brown for the main shadow, and then use the dark brown for the shadow underneath the helmet. With some DFX black, I start outlining. And this was taking me so long that I just, I think I just kept forgetting to record. But the outlining is pretty self-explanatory. Next, I'm just mixing colors to make a darker red and a darker blue to add some more shading. And take my DFX white from earlier and do some highlighting. Next, I've got some tag gray, dark blue, and light blue to do my least favorite part of this look. Covering myself in one solid color is by far the worst part of any tutorial. I wish I had an airbrush, but I just make it work with what I got. I use some DFX black to outline everything in the signature Mega Man style. And then I paint my neck with some Snazaroo black. It's coming off as gray because I had some white on the brush. Here I'm taking that Snazaroo black and trying to add some shading to my chest, but what I found works better is using these cream Cinema Secrets face paints in white and black for highlight and shadow. They're really pigmented and they're creamy and they just blend a lot better than using my water-based paints. And there you have the finished look. I hope you liked this tutorial. It was really hard, so please share it, like it, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.